Oh no, their meetings happens um, actually quite regularly. Um, in fact, I have a meeting that's already was scheduled with uh, uh, my counterparts in the coming weeks. Actually, a number of meetings, um, and I look forward to having the discussions at that time. But not being invited to this one, does that not say that Canada is seemingly on the outside? Oh, not at all. I, actually, uh, in terms of uh, um, a lot of these meetings about uh, getting up to date on what's uh, what's happening on the ground, and I was very fortunate on actually two occasions, and most recently been back into into the, into the region to get a first and uh, look at what's going on, talk to the actual commanders on the ground, and which allowed me to uh, get a great sense and, and refine um, the uh, contributions that we'll be making as, as a country to the overall fight. But why, why not invite it? Why not invite it? Well, like I said, meetings happen all the time. There's a number of other meetings that happen that you may not be actually aware of. Uh, one of the reasons is I'm also going to have a meeting in NORAD that, uh, that's happening in a, in a couple of days. It's very important to me as well. Um, and there's con contribution that happens on, on a regular basis. Um, um, I like to stay updated, which uh, I am. That's just from my, from my background. Uh, that's the nature of how, how I work. And I have a couple of meetings that are going to be coming up in the next, next few weeks on to talk about ISIL.